Hello and welcome to New Filmmakers Los Angeles in partnership with Movie Maker Magazine. My name is Danny Delito and we're here at the Cambridge Los Angeles showroom in West Hollywood and I'm here with Mary C. Russell with her movie Carved. Let's take a look at a clip. Say hello to these four sex kids <laughs> on their way to Las Vegas. Okay, seriously, you need to slow down. Seriously? Shut up. But what comes their way is not what they expected. <laughs> Didn't see that coming, did you? What the fuck did you just do, Ebony? I don't know. I think I hit a deer or something. Or maybe you hit a fucking police officer. It's a fucking police officer. <laughs> See the horror film Carved, where there will be sexy girls, scary things, and yeah, um, more scary things. Mary, it's awesome to have you here. Um, tell us a brief synopsis of your movie Carved. It's about an inmate spirit that possesses people on the road to Las Vegas. I mean, that in itself is enough to watch it. I mean, I'm already, I'm already taken in. You're already hooked. I'm hooked already. <laughs> um, it, your movie was great. And Thank I, you. I loved uh, the, the audience reaction last night was, was just as fascinating as to watch it. Um, now, you directed and you wrote and you produced this film. Yeah. That's a, lot, that's a lot of hats you carried there. Yeah, it was definitely a difficult uh, situation because a couple of people dropped out of the production and I had to take over. Um, on location scouting, the production side of things, and so I had to move forward and you know push through the hard times and yeah. get to the good, you know. The, the, the beauty <laughs> of independent filmmaking. Yeah, right? the beauty of uh, independent filmmaking. Well, you and made it look easy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you did. Uh, now you had some great, great acting talent there. How did you find your actor actresses? I actually went through cast mm -hmm. um, and spent four days casting uh, these wonderful actresses and my main actress Angelica Chitwood actually starred in a feature film called The Chosen and she's kind of getting a lot bigger now and that's good for me. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and, uh, and she's an incredible actress and, uh, and then... I also worked to find the other um, girls through cast too, and I spent a long time because I, I'm really, really particular when it comes to actors, um, and I don't want to mess up when it comes to that because I see so many films make that mistake. Um, and coming from acting myself, I love you know like working with professional mm -hmm. actors mm -hmm. and. I, I don't want to see, you know, someone, you know, like, who doesn't have the passion in it that, um, you know, like, to progress and, and make what, you know, I want to make with them. And, yeah. um, and someone who doesn't have that passion, you know, you can tell mm -hmm. uh, when they first start reading the script. Mm -hmm. and, um, and that's basically how I found each girl, because I could tell hey, they're into this, you know, hey, they have a passion yeah. for this silly grindhouse horror, mm -hmm. hey, they're going to do something crazy with me, they're going to go out to the desert and spend nights in the freezing cold <laughs> in booty shorts yeah. and, you know, risk getting hypothermia. Yeah. Um, all, the, all the things we do in independent filmmaking, yeah. isn't it? you know, so yeah. Um, I find it really refreshing to have a, a sort of all female cast in in this genre, yeah. which I I think was was great. Was that something that was thought about for you, or is that something you want to show empowering female roles in this genre, or is that just kind of how it came about? Um, it just kind of came about, I guess. Um, we did have two male actors in the very beginning, um, but very briefly, because mm -hmm. yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> both of them. <laughs> got yeah, murdered. Well, well, yeah, for yeah, long. yeah. Spoiler alert. <laughs> they did, they don't survive very long. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but I did put a lot into the main character who was Ebony, and mm -hmm. I kind of based her off of some of the personality traits of myself, and then mm -hmm. also um, the other four girls. I wanted to make them really different from each other, so yeah. that each of them. You, you would want to watch them, mm -hmm. and you would want to watch them get murdered. Yeah. Because um, 
they're entertaining to watch. They were very, and they had a great synergy together as well. Yeah. It really, you could really feel that on camera. Um, now, you said, you've mentioned a few things that took place that were, were challenging. What, what was your, your biggest challenge making this film? My biggest challenge was probably the last night of shooting, oh, right. <laughs> um, which was shooting out in Santa Monica, uh, uh, no, so, sorry, San, Santa Clarita, mm -hmm. uh, in the desert, Wow! and it was freezing cold, people did not bring the right <laughs> amount of clothing, right. um, my actors were getting pretty angry at me. Uh, they were in, but which I kept, works for the film. It's yeah, yeah, nice, which yeah. Really works really well <laughs> for the film. Plus, like the main actress was um, supposed to be a murderer anyway, so yeah, she was able um, to release that tension. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I think that, uh, but but I but I think that night was kind of a very challenging night. But I think I learned how to work with a ton of people on set mm -hmm. and working with different personalities and kind of getting t everyone together as a team, mm -hmm. you know, when people are uncomfortable, yeah. making sure that everyone's happy. That's like yeah. the most, like making sure that there's, you know, like- the producer hat, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, putting on the producer hat, because mm -hmm. I had to. You, you know, you took on three three hats for this, for this film. What is it like after all the hard work that you've done to be selected for New Filmmakers Los Angeles? Um, it's awesome. I mean, I feel like really, you know, happy and lucky to like be able to work with you guys with the new filmmakers LA and um, I'm super happy to and I really enjoyed working with you guys and um, a very professional festival with that, professional. <laughs> very professional even at the after party the, okay. <laughs> the after party is good um, <laughs> but I, I think that like as a beginning you know kind of a new filmmaker I think to sh to showcase your work um, and to showcase your voice. Mm -hmm. I think this is a great setting. And especially someone who is partaking in a different genre, mm -hmm. um, you want to uh, like show your voice. Yeah. And, and I think this is a great setting to do that. Well, we loved having your film. Thanks. Um, what, what's next for you, Mary? And I'm going to make Carved a feature. This so is exciting. I very, hope very that good. You'll and uh, and please follow, please um, follow Mary um, C. Russell's journey because uh, some very exciting things come up for for Carved as a feature. Um, so we're looking forward to seeing that. I'm excited to see that. Um, and it's going to be very exciting, isn't it, Mary? Yeah, yeah. But, you know, we're just giving a little bit of a spoiler alert, but uh, that's coming up. But no, congratulations on your film, Mary. It was a pleasure, and uh, we look forward to following